All right, in this video, before I do an actual full-blown review on this one, which is made very nice uh, by a, a person in New Mexico here in the United States, I'm going to go through what the meaning of the La, Sto La Stovka means. And this is stuff I'm still learning, so I was reading up on it, and I wanted to give you the meaning. So we'll start here where the flaps or the... Uh, uh, the flaps are also called leaves, symbolizing the four evangelists. So you have like Matthew, Mar Matthew, Mark, Luke, Luke, and John. So that's the four evangelists for the leaves. And then the stitching around here, which is really a dark brown stitching, so it's hard to see on this one, means the teaching of the gospel. Then you'll notice it starts off with these three, and he sealed them with gold, uh, larger um, beads. And you'll see... A total of nine through the rope and that's uh for the um the nine orders of angels and for the nine months during which the most pure mother of god carried in her womb the infant who is before all ages and then you'll notice right after that you have this uh i guess a, a juncture uh and it's flat so that means the earth, and right after that you'll see there's 12 beads right here representing the 12 apostles. And the earth represents the 12 apostles when they walked on the earth. And then, I wrote down some notes here, so hopefully I get this all right. And then right after that you'll see there's 39 beads here, 39 total. And those are for the 39 weeks and two days in which the Theotokos carried Christ in her womb. And then after that, you have 17, which symbolize the 17 prophets who prophesied concerning Christ. And then at the very end, you're going to have, uh, oh, I'm sorry, 33 steps. Let me go back. Sorry about that. So you have 33 steps that represent the 33 years the Lord walked on the earth. Then after that, you'll have the 17, ending with the 17 steps or counters uh, that symbolize the 17 prophets who prophesied concerning Christ. Now, like any prayer rope, uh, you know, you can pray anything with it. I'm going to do a video on a prayer that a lot of people pray with this. But the most common prayer with any prayer rope, of course, is the Jesus prayer. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. And there's different variants of that. But uh, I wanted to tell you the meaning of this. And I just will go over this, I guess, really quick and overview, overview before I go through a more in-depth uh, review of it. It's just really well made. Did a really good job. Used really good leather. And uh, everything's handmade. So, and I will, on the next video, when I'm reviewing this one, I'm going to review two of them at the same time. Uh, I will put in the information where you can order this in the U.S., which is great because if you're looking for something, most likely you're going to have to order from, like, Greece or you have to order from Russia or you're going to have to order, you know, from different places. And it takes, you know, it could take a month or even two months before you get it. Whereas if you order from this guy when he has some made, um, then you'll be able to get these uh you know, fairly quickly. I think it only took, you know, three days and after I, three or four days after I ordered it and it was in the mail. So really, really well done. Very beautiful uh, leather work. In fact, it's making me want to, uh, I think I'm going to start making these myself too, but I do want to, uh, you know, support our local brothers and sisters who make stuff in the United States so people in the United States can get uh, these great items. All right, till next time. Good day. God bless.